first and foremost, we're going to give all praises, honor, and glory unto your help, Ashmael Shai, double honors to the elders and the apostles, a great millstone, peace and salutations to the Akimath on the four corners, teaching the truth and sincerity. This is Tasha Rokar Moth of the GMS Dallas camp, coming at you with a quick hit, you know, get in, get out, right? Uh, <laughs> uh, I'm just gonna, I'm going to jump right into it, all right? Um, it says, uh, this is Isaiah 53 and 1, it says, who hath believed our report? And to whom is the arm of Yahweh by Shimei Shai revealed? You know, going to, you know, asking these these Jakes of these other camps, these Jakes that are, are just coming into the knowledge of Yahweh by Shimei Shai. You know, who who has heard, you know, Great Millstone preach year in and year out, you know, weekly. You know, on the highways and byways, you know, and if 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 they are wavering, they're seeing prophecy come to pass, and knowing that through the spirit and power of Yahweh by Shemuel Shai, his prophets, you know, has said this before, and that's what prophesying means is to say before, okay. So again, the question is, who hath believed our report? You know, who has believe the report from on high all right and whom so like it and to whom is the arm the power of Yahweh by Shimei Shai revealed all right because only those that the power are revealed to will prophesy according to scripture okay so with this whole um MOTB you know that's that's being pushed on a global scale now who told you that before? Who who was the group that put all bullshit aside, Slaki for my speech, and was like, this is what it is. You know, and we came out of scripture, you know, from the elders and the apostles on down to the the men, you know, on the highways and byways. We came from the scriptures to proclaim. And now you're going to be uh, 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 left with a decision to make. I'm going to go to Ecclesiasticus. Just a quick hit. 41. I'm going to start at 1. It says, O death, how bitter. Salakia. Uh, o death, how bitter is the remembrance of thee to a man that liveth at rest in his possessions. Uh, unto the man that hath nothing to vex him and that um, ha has uh, hath prosperity in all things, yea, unto him that yet, uh, so like that is yet able to receive me. Okay? Now, this is a lot in one verse. Okay? It says, O death. You know, or um, uh, uh, killing or, you know, to be removed from, you know. Death, how bitter is the remembrance of thee to a man that liveth at rest in his, in his possession, so in the things of this world, you know. Now, if you believe the report, you would have gotten out of the things of this world. You would have been more on the spiritual mindset set to... Remove yourself from this world because the love of this world is enmity with the Most High, as it says in James. So, it's, you know, oh death, how bitter is the remembrance whenever you remember the things that you had instead of the things that you are going to acquire. Faith, faith gives you that hope, you know, because we are prisoners of hope. We are prisoners of faith. You know, to acquire those things necessary for us to survive in this lifetime. It's 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 an understanding. Y'all y'all have to understand, man. How about Shimmy Al Shai put everything in its proper order for a reason? And call Haloyum like how about Shimmy Al Shai that he did, that he gave those elect one hundred and forty four thousand and the one third the eye sal to see the things around them. All right, being circumspect. All right, and you know, um, uh, 
with that, we see these these uh, issues coming to pass. You know, if you don't have the MOTB here in the near future, you're not going to be able to move around, you know, according like you used to. Okay? And through the spirit and power of Yahweh by Shemiah we uh we we see that coming to fruition because everything else has lined up. So again, <laughs> who hath believed our report? <laughs> All right, and if you believe the report, Lord's will, you know, through the spirit and power of Yahweh by Shemiah he will stretch out that power to you or his arm, as it says in the uh, the Isaiah fifty three, but. Uh, it says, um, uh, unto the man that has nothing to vex him. Because when you have things to vex you, you have your, you know, children, you have your wife, you know, you, you have property, you have things that you have to worry about in this life. Whenever a man of, of, of Yahweh by Shemiel Shai, who lives according to the spirit, doesn't live in the uh, things that he has around him. He lives according to the will, stretch, and power of Yahweh by Shemiah Shai. All right, continuing on. It says, And that hath prosperity in all things, yea, unto him that is yet able to, rec to, to receive meat, to him that is ready to uh, receive this understanding. All right, because meat, you know, you, 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 you got to chew on it a little bit, you know. You got to chew on it a little bit, sit, let it marinate, meditate on it, you know, because these things are about to come to pass, all right? And we have had ample amount of time to get our house in order, you know? So this is just, you know, Baba Kusha, you know, please listen, get yourself in order and understand that all of this is coming down the pipe, all right? So I just wanted to come in and, do, do, do a quick hit. Lord's willing. This is edifying to the hopeful elect. Hey, shalom.